I accidentally drank a couple cigarette butts. <laughs> At least I wasn't eating my dad's chonies. Those are underwears in Spanish. All right, all right. Uh, I give it up right now for a friend of mine who is a very funny guy, Mr. Angelo Santos. All right, people, get ready. Buckle up, brother. <laughs> Uh, the white chocolate portion of the show is about to start, and I'm bittersweet, all right? How you doing, guys? My name is Angelo Santos, right? You know, um, I'm from Brooklyn, you know. Um, to be born in Manhattan is, uh, is a privilege, but to be born in Brooklyn and where and who your family are is an honor, all right? Uh, my family is um, from the Red Hook Prospect Park section of Brooklyn, and uh, back in the day, it was one of the neighborhoods that you would... You know, you could mess up and end up in the Gowanus Canal real fast, okay? but let's just say, okay? So, um, I want to say tonight that uh, I want to start something new. Hello, my fellow humorist. Good night, you know, we are, we're here tonight, we're all here today. We got some new people to shoot at tonight. These are in trouble, I'm going to tell you right now. <laughs> all right, all right. So, what I want to say is that, you know Chris Rock, right? I used to work with his daddy. Okay, and uh, I, I I love Chris Rock's father like a brother. We're in the same unit, but that fucking movie that he made, Good Hair, I hate his fucking guts, man, because I didn't know. You know what I'm saying? I, 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 Angelo, Angelo's first girl that he ever kissed was black. So you know, I don't see color. You know what I'm saying? At the Cheerios commercial, I didn't see nothing wrong with it until they made a a big thing about it. I was like. Well, no, I, actually, I was bitching up from tearing from the girl putting the, 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 the Cheerios on daddy's chest. I was like, wow! And then when they said something about it, I was like, what the fuck is wrong with that shit? I didn't see nothing, you know what I mean? So that's what I'm trying to say. So, all right. <laughs> so, uh, I want to talk about, um, there's a place that I used to work at. I was a bouncer for many years in many, in many clubs in Brooklyn, Manhattan with Madonna at the Fun House, and then... There's a place in uh, Malibu Beach called the Doom Room that Angelo used to be at. About. The last place I was a bouncer in. And uh, one night Angelo was drunk and he, he was hitting on Paris Hilton, but he didn't know it. <laughs> and actually, I thought I was fucking doing great. I, I'm just telling you right now. I didn't know it. All right? This is, you know, because nobody walks around with fucking eye, eye, you know, name tags. So I said, okay. So, you know, I walk up to us, oh, I see, I see everybody talking to us like, Oh, where you been? I haven't seen you in such a long time. I said, you know, you know. I, and so I started saying, so she goes to the bathroom. The place is very small. I'm saying, the, about as big as this fucking place. But I mean, the money that goes to this place, buy this whole fucking block. And I'm not kidding. So I, I'm just looking at it. I see her walking by to the bathroom. I see her, I say, oh, so you seem like you be the flavor of the month. How you doing? My name is Angela. I'm bouncing here on the week. I said, yeah, I know. My friends told me. I said, so I says, uh, so what's your name? She goes, oh, my name is Paris. I go, Paris? Oh, I've been to Paris. I never been, you know, when I was in the army, it went right over my fucking head. It was, I was drunk. I didn't know who she was the next fucking day. The next day I fucking walk in, everybody's making fun of me. Said, did you see Angel last night hitting on fucking Paris Hilton? I was like, is that who that was? Bring her fucking back because I didn't know, you know? And there was a few people that were like that, that did the same thing to me, you know? Okay, and I, once I heard uh, a little angel, uh, a mermaid sing by the name of Chloe. All right, that's how I'm giving you a shout out. Okay. <laughs> so, um, another place that I used to be is in, in Brooklyn, in Bounce. Okay, I said, is the, um, I was Bounce in Brooklyn, and one night these two midgets walk in. And I ain't never seen this shit. I seen everything in my fucking life. They walk in like they was fucking. I, first, I thought two kids walked into the fucking place. Because they walk in and they see two chairs, they fucking running for the chair. <laughs> so, I'm amazed. Cause I, I'm looking at them, how the fuck are they going to get up on the stool? How the fuck is he gonna take a piss? He's this fucking big. The urinal starts at this fucking big. And you know, they're like, how are you gonna do it? You know, so, and then they're doing the table dance. And I'm telling you, these fucking guys are throwing money like confetti. Now, they're getting a little handsy problem. So the people are mad. A couple of customers say, no man, I don't give a fuck who he is. He touched that girl again, I'm gonna smash him in the face. So I, I have to you know, do something real fast. So the guy goes, he grabs the tree string again. I grab the motherfucker. I go, come on. And then as I go to take him out, he goes down into a little fucking boy. I turn around and I, I say, okay, you little motherfucker, come on, back to the little fucking 
the, the chocolate factory trying to make cookies, candies, and never loving God stop is you little bastard. Get the fuck out of here. My name is Angelo Santos. Thank you very much. Give it up for Angelo Santos. Or as he says, Angelo Santos.